feel like when final season start, it's like the end of the semester, there's like a slow little break and then it goes like full speed ahead. Anyways, my first final is tomorrow. Like I said on my last vlog, I have five more weeks of notes to consolidate. I can do that easy, but it's currently 12.18. I have a meeting in 40 minutes-ish and I need to eat first. My mom made some arepa. Nesti de durazno. Oh, that's so good. My hypothesis is that if you make an arepa, specifically if it's filled with cheese, you let it sit in an aluminum foil little thing for like a couple minutes, maybe like five minutes or something. I feel like it tastes way better. It just really gives time for the arepa and the butter to really soak in there and marinate. The arepa. Mm. Cheers. I showered in a dash, put on <laughs> a random sweater, didn't have time. It's a call. So it's, they're only gonna see me from here up. I have my light on for this call yes i do the call is like about an hour it starts in four minutes i'm just gonna sit here look cute look professional do my thing after this i have to record my tiktoks of the day my youtube video is posting it's like 21 percent posted i'm gonna let that run in the back while i do my thing i have yet to record any tiktoks for today i was meant to post my youtube video hold on let me put you down public done save it's live. It was taking forever to upload and then it took two seconds. Remember how I built a studio? Well, the tape fell off, so I have to rebuild it, retape it, put it up again. I'm gonna record an outfit video. Is the outfit I wore yesterday, which actually I really liked, and I was like, you know what? Let me record it because I'm gonna take oh take off the studio <laughs> tomorrow. I mean today after I finish. So I'm gonna tape this back up. I was originally thinking of buying a backdrop stand along with a backdrop. The stand is 60 bucks, which is fine. That's doable. The backdrop though, the paper was like um, $100 or something. The studio is back up. The tape is working overtime. It's up and running. Let me do this as fast as possible. So in case it falls, I get the shot first. You guys, my camera broke. My camera fell off my tripod. I'm using it right now, but it fell off my tripod. And now I can't see the screen. Like the screen doesn't... I can't see it. It doesn't turn on or off. Like the camera shows, like there's a blinking button in the back that it shows me that it's recording, but I can't see what it's recording. So I'm just like recording blind. It's the fact that it fell and I was like, dang, this camera has fallen like three or four times in the past few days. She's really like um, a trooper. No, she didn't make it. Oh, I don't have money to replace a camera. So hopefully it's recording, but it's like a black screen. Let me show you. Do you see how it's a black screen? Do you see? Okay, ignore the mess in my room. But it's a black screen. I don't know if it's focused. I don't know if I'm in frame, hoping that I am. I don't even know if the audio is working. This is not the unexpected expense that I needed at the end of the year. So I looked up online. I don't know if you can just fix a LCD screen. My plan is to try to find an HDMI cord because this has a HDMI port, the camera does. Connect that to my laptop to see if I can see the screen mirrored on my laptop. Can't find the cord, so we're gonna have to find the cord first. My second plan is to buy an external monitor. There's an external monitor that you can put at the top of the camera, which is gonna make overall my camera more bulky, but the camera's not broken broken, like it doesn't record, doesn't take pictures. It's just the screen is broken, so I can't see what I'm doing. And what's the most important thing with this job? Seeing what I'm doing to make sure I'm in the frame and I'm in the shot. That's gonna cost me 200 bucks. The monitor itself, 200 bucks. Then I need a new tripod because, why did this break? Because this tripod made my camera fall. So that's gonna run me like 250. But that is cheaper than buying a new body because a new body for my camera is $700. I will also be taking this to a camera shop to see if they can quote me on how much it is to change and fix the screen. But use those other things in the meanwhile. In the meanwhile, I'm just hoping that this is recording. And I can only check if it's done recording by putting it back in the computer and checking if there's a file, a new file. I'm gonna also take a hip hop class tonight. Ugh, I'm so scared. I don't remember the last time I took a dance class that wasn't like I don't remember the last time I took a hip-hop class If you guys didn't know I was a competitive dancer back in the day tap ballet acro uh, Musical theater everything. That's why I love to dance so much the Last time I took a hip-hop class. Don't know my friend that lives here said she goes like on Wednesdays. She's like come on. Let's go Scared so now I have to find a groovy outfit because when I'm in class if my I feel good in my outfit I dance better Sorry, that's the thing. So I need to find like a, I like it like really big and baggy. 
nice movable pants and like a big baggy shirt. Hopefully this is still recording. Literally what my quote of the rest of the vlog is until I get the monitor and fix this thing. Hopefully this is still recording. Bread is warm and fresh. Babe, I just wanna take a bite. We got some platano, some green onions. Right now we're getting all the ingredients for the ayacas. Ayacas is a traditional Venezuelan meal that you eat during Christmas time. So we're gathering all those ingredients now. We're at the Latin food store. I don't know if this is recording. We're gonna find out later. We're getting chicken and beef for the ayacas. Usually you do it with cerdo, tocineta, that's pork, bacon, pork, bacon, beef? Pork, bacon, beef, and chicken mix in one. But we're just gonna do beef and chicken. It's always a party at the Latin food market. At the Latin grocery store. First hip hop class in maybe a year. That dance class humbled me, bro. She did like, I don't know how many minutes of abs. And I was like, dang. I didn't know we were going right into dance training. Love the song that we she picked. Love the choreo. I wish we had like another 20, 30 minutes to really perfect it because it was like really go, 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 go. Again, I haven't taken an actual hip hop dance class in probably years. I've danced here and there, but like taking an actual dance class. And it's crazy because dance was such a big part of my life for like literally my entire first 18 years and then i just cut it cold turkey which is probably a bad idea i'm tired i'm exhausted um today's the day that i need to clean my room do you see the mess yeah i just finished exam number one there's two more one's on tuesday one's on thursday tuesdays is also open book so here's the thing i made my notes for this exam right but I also screenshotted some of the slides because some of the slides had like, anyways, some wording that the presenter notes in the transcript didn't have. So I screenshotted it. Why, as I was taking my exam, I was using control F and it wasn't control Fing the screenshots? Mm hmm. So now, tonight or tomorrow, I'm going to start preparing my Tuesday notes. And then also tonight, I need to start reviewing my intellectual exam for thursday because tuesday's exam another control f my way through it thursday's exam the noggin now that i have my thoughts together i'm gonna file my hit and run and i think you can file it online did this incident occur within the city of los angeles yes you guys don't know not last vlog the vlog before the last clip someone hit my car and kept driving I kind of gave up on this police report because online it says like the last step that you were not you didn't see the accident happen and you weren't in the vehicle yet i was in the vehicle when it happened anyways i still submitted it online because i've been on the phone for over an hour you've reached the los angeles police no that you've reached the los angeles but do you see the hour do you see it no bye goodness gracious so i submitted the online report and at the bottom i said i know it says that when you submit this you're not supposed to be like you didn't see it happen but i was on the phone for over an hour and i waited for the hour mark to happen so i can hang up <laughs> literally hung up on the hour because no i do need to clean my room though <clears throat> it's so messy like so messy it's it's a direct depiction of what my brain feels like yeah